In this tutorial in CyberLink PowerDirector, we'd like to show you how to use one of these new special effects available for titles called Fire. It allows you to set letters on fire. This is available now in version 17, and it's one of six special effects that you can apply to your titles. I have on the screen a promo for a sale and Auto City is going to have a hot sale. But what we'd like to do is make it even hotter by taking the letters in the title Hot Sale and setting them on fire. Let me show you how we can do that, then we'll talk about the variations in using this tool. I can click on my title and double click, or I can press the F2 key to get into my title designer in PowerDirector version 17. And one of the things I have in this one is an effect tab if I'm on the advanced. If you're on the basic tab, you won't see it. So in the top and the middle, simply click on advanced. And then we're going to, in this tab, click on the effect, the center one. And we have a new category here called special effects. This will open up six different new options. The default is no effect. We're going to click on the title that we want to impact. It'll be our hot sale. And then we'll click on fire. Now, the interesting thing about this one that says an applied effect keyframes will be reset except the opacity setting. Do you want to continue? Now, I had a special effect where it crawled in from the left. If I apply this, that will no longer work. So I'll say yes. And now immediately it gave me fire. Now this is look number one. Let's look at the options here. I have a size option and the size option will go from 0 to 100. Then I have a density option that will go from 0 to 200. When we're done with this, I'm going to show you a, a contrast of the differences in these sliders. But the truth is, when I apply this, I can't tell much visible difference on density. I can a lot on size. There are also, to this one and the other five, there are six different looks. And in a moment, I'll show you a, an option where you can see how they are different one from the other. Highlight my title, and then I can determine the size of my flame. And you see it changing as I go from 200 virtually down to nothing. I would su uh, suspect most of us would pick something between 50 and 200 in order to make it stand out. And uh, we'll just go in the middle, maybe in the 130s. And I'll click on OK. And now if I play my clip, my title clip, with hot sale, it did not move. I lost my motion, but I was able to ignite my letters. And obviously they show better in front of the truck than they do in front of a white background. But that's how that particular option works. In the new category called Special Effects in PowerDirector 17 titles. Let me show you now what you can find in the other options in this particular tool. The first one it relates to size and density. You have two sliders. You can adjust the size from 0 to 100 and the density from 0 to 200. I found that the size makes a lot more difference than the density. Let me play this and I'll show you. When we play this, we find the first one is size of 10, density of 200, and then size of 10, density of only 20. I don't see much difference. But the size does make a difference. Look, this is size 10, density 100, and size 175, density 100. So I basically wouldn't adjust the density, but I would adjust the size because that makes a huge difference in the use of this tool. Now the second thing you need to note is there are six looks. The first one is a standard one. The second one is a green fire. The third one that you're going to see in a moment is kind of a blue pilot-like fire. The next one that we see is a kind of a blue elect electric fire, puffy. The next one is a fragmented fire. And number six is a fire that has a little bit more black or ash, it looks like, in it than a pure fire. 
So those are the six options that you have when it comes to changing the look of your fire. So the three ways you can modify it is size and density, and I would say size is the only one to worry about. And the last one is simply one of these six looks that you see on the screen in this example.